familiar sound and a familiar face. Though many refer to him as the bugler, Nelson gave us a little insight into the instrument which has increased his popularity. This is actually a trumpet, right? The bugler has no valve. I started playing this instrument when I was about 16 years old. That would have been in 19, 1989. I, jo I joined, I was a member of the Chan Tobago Cadet Force Band here in Tobago from 1987 till the year 2010 when I then went into the Chan Tobago Defense Force Reserve. But what is the secret to maintaining his musical notes? Mr. Nelson said it is all in the mouth and the diaphragm. There's roughly 225 cell muscles around the mouth that you must develop. Picking it up and trying to play it, you would stretch the muscles, you will get sore. So as I said, I've been playing for the last 32 years, right? This diaphragm in your belly is where most of it comes from. Not only are persons fascinated by his musical skill, a major attraction is the trumpeter's unique outfits at each event. And there are events where you have the champion or champion or whoever. I try to bring something new to the fold every year. I try to do something to keep the people up and expecting something. There, there are some people come to the buku just to see the bugler, what he's wearing every year. I was I was privileged to meet a German this year. He brought back some pictures. Though a St. Vincent native, Nelson shared he moved to Tobago at the age of two and has since fallen in love with the country. For the next two months, he'll be taking a hiatus from his trumpeter role and will be in flagman mode. But come July 27th, I will be coming from Castara, doing a walk from Castara to Crown Point with the national flag in memory of those people who had lost their life in the 1990 attempted coup here in Trinidad and Tobago. And hopefully on August 1st emancipation, I, God willing, I will love to do a walk from Charlotteville to Kong Point. Mr. Nelson hopes young musicians will master the skill of playing the trumpet and continue his legacy. I am Carissa Douglas for TTT News, and I love Tobago.